Hello, my fellow comic book hobbyists. Today, we're going to be reviewing uh, my comic book. What are you book. doing? I'm reviewing a comic book. I'm supposed to be doing a comic book haul. You can't just jump behind the camera and do what Why you want. Why not? Uh, because this is my channel. Let's see what you got anyways. This is a Masters of the Universe Origins comic book. Nobody wants to see this. I believe the viewers would rather look at the figure than this. If I took over your channel, it would be a whole lot better and you'd get more views. Why, you little... I'm gonna get you. You can't get me. Well, that's not a good place to hide. Why not? You're about to find out. The Rancor's in here? Hello my fellow comic book hobbyists, I paid a little visit to my local comic book shop and let's look at what I got. First we have Wolverine issue 18, cool cover and I simply just got this because well it's Wolverine. By now you already know that I have issue 17 and I haven't read it yet because I actually want to get a hold of the other issues and work my way from one all the way to these. So I can get a better understanding of the story. Alright, second we got Star Wars Bounty Hunters. Really, really liking this cover as well. We got Mr. Bosk up front with the rest of the crew behind him. Being a big fan of Star Wars, I pretty much have to get myself on my hands on anything that's Star Wars. Those green colors seem to bring out the, the cover out. Moving on to the third and next to bat is Star Wars Crimson Rain. This is one of the the books I anticipated and you already know why I got this one because it has Darth Vader on the cover look at that fantastic you don't know the power of the dark side you don't know the power comic books have over you another book I anticipated was Wastelanders Wolverine issue one I know some people took a pass on this but I simply got it because well Wolverine's on the cover and I want to read it, and I'm kind of interested what this story is about. I like the cover. It's not a, it's not a, a an eye catcher, but it's a decent cover. Again, I just wanted to see what this is about, and, and I can't wait to read it. I might do a review. I don't know. Nah, probably not. I had to go with some Venom. Sorry, comic book worm. I know you're burned out with Venom, but... <laughs> I'm a big Venom fan as well. I don't mean to put you through the pain of seeing another Venom comic. Cover your eyes, man. Cover your eyes. I'm just teasing him. He's a fantastic guy. I just had to get me some more Venom. I already had issue one, so might as well get issue two. Last but not least, everybody's been talking about this. This is Batman 118. Of course, this is the variant cover, but this cover is wicked sick. I heard that the storyline is rather interesting as well, and well, from my, my first Batman comic, I went with this. I have a feeling I'm going to enjoy this, but anyways, let's go ahead and pick out our favorite cover. My favorite pick goes to Batman 118. The cover's so dark, it's mysterious, it's dirty, it's just an eye catcher. This just screams, look at me, I'm a cool cover. Fantastic, fantastic. Hey, look, y'all stay tuned. I have, a, I have a haul coming in from Midtown Comics. Until then, thank you for watching. Give me a like, subscribe, and like always, get a hobby and live life.